Hey, what's up? It's Pat Parra. In this video, I'm going to give you some tips on how you can get started freestyle rapping, how you can start improvising. Freestyle rapping is really great for songwriting. All different types of artists use improvisation to write songs. So there's two main stages in creativity. There's improvising and the editing stage. And a lot of people are comfortable with editing and taking their time to fix their lines, but a lot of people have problems with the first stage of improvisation. People who have problems with improvisation have a hard time coming up with lyrics, coming up with freestyles, creating songs, and starting to make music. So that's what I want to focus on in this video, to help you guys get started improvising, get comfortable being in a flow so that you can write songs and that you can freestyle and you can rap and just kind of even impress your friends with this skill. It's a fun skill to have. So the first thing you want to focus on are the two golden rules of freestyle rapping. This is what I teach in my classes. And the number one rule is when you're starting out, don't worry about rhyming. See, a lot of people when starting freestyle rapping, they're worried about rhyming. They want to sound just like Kendrick Lamar or J. Cole right from the start. So they'll focus on rhyming, 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 and they'll maybe freestyle a couple lines, you know, well, they'll rhyme, and then they'll not be able to come up with a rhyme in time, and then they'll quit. So if you don't worry about rhyming and you focus on just flowing, that's the key. So that's the key. It's kind of doing the opposite. The key to learning how to freestyle is the first golden rule is don't worry about rhyming so that you can just practice getting into a flow. And the second golden rule is don't stop if you mess up. So with those two golden rules, that can help you get started. So again, the reason that you want to avoid rhyming when you're first starting out is so that you can develop a flow. Once you are comfortable flowing without rhyming for a minute, that's when you're going to be able to start throwing rhymes in there and it'll be a lot more natural. You just kind of allow yourself to slowly start throwing rhymes in there. You can just throw in one rhyme at a time per freestyle and then the next freestyle you do try to throw in two rhymes and that will build your freestyle muscle and you'll get more and more comfortable rhyming. And you can start out freestyling just rhyming like cat and bat, really simple rhyme words just to get you started. But before you get into rhyming, remember, you want to be able to flow and just allow yourself to just go without worrying about rhyming. So for example, I'll talk about some things I see in, in this room. I'll just freestyle right now without rhyming and it'll show you that you can turn anything into a rap. And that's the experience that you really want. You want the experience of being able to turn anything into a rap, anything around you, any kind of feeling. You want to just understand that. And the best way to understand that is to just start flowing without worrying about rhyming. So I'm looking at the light. It's looking kind of dull. I don't understand why I'm here. It's not great. I'm looking at my girl. I don't know where she is. I wish she was here with me right now. And if you notice, that doesn't sound that cool. It doesn't sound that tight. But just allowing yourself to just flow and freestyle and just flow like that and just, you know, remember the second golden rule. Don't stop if you mess up. That'll help you break through that fear of freestyling because there's no pressure to rhyme. There's no pressure to rhyme. And then once you're comfortable flowing again for a minute, that's when you can start throwing rhymes in there, all right? So I hope those two tips help you. Those are the two golden rules to get started freestyle rapping. Those are the two golden rules that I learned when I was 16. I was looking for a way to express myself. I was really depressed. And my friend Mark was really good at freestyling. He gave me those two golden rules, and that helped me get started. I wasn't very good starting out, but that helped me get started. And then in college, a girl asked me how to freestyle rap, and I came up with these four steps that get people freestyle rapping really fast, a lot faster than I did. So it took me three years to get really good at it. But with these four steps, you can, you can learn a lot faster than I learned. And I have a link below in the description where you can get my full class. It's the only rap training that goes back and forth on video. We teach you how to freestyle, go through the four steps back and forth. Then we go to the three top skills to make you an advanced pro level freestyle rapper. And so you're not just freestyling, you're able to really impress your friends. And then we go into a more advanced training. My course also includes the eight steps to rapping like the pros and how to write raps using freestyling. So it started out as just a course about freestyling and it turned into this course all about taking you from a beginning rapper that doesn't know anything about rap. You know, you learn how to freestyle rap in your first five minutes and then from there we teach you more advanced stuff. So that's below if you're interested in that. And be sure to subscribe for more free tips on how you can succeed with rapping. All right, thanks a lot. Bye.